In this video, you will learn how to build a concrete block wall. The tools that you will need are mortar pan, trowel, brush, plumb bob, string, straight edge and brick supports for profiles. The materials that you will need are mortar and concrete blocks. Don't forget to use personal protective equipment including safety gloves, reflective jacket, safety helmet, safety shoes and dust mask. Before you begin building, set up the profiles to guide the first course. Here we have used concrete blocks as profiles and bricks to hold the strings in place. Make cement slurry by mixing one part of cement over 10 parts of water. Using a brush, apply the slurry on the ground between the profiles so that the ground doesn't absorb the water from the mortar bed. You may now lay the mortar bed for the first course of the first wall. Maintain a thickness of 12 to 15 mm when applying mortar. Begin laying the first course by placing the coin block in a stretcher position. Adjust the block, aligning it with the profiles. Apply half a centimeter of mortar on the heading side of the coin block. Now, place the next block also in stretcher position to take the second space. Align the block with the profile. Continue to place more blocks in stretcher position till the end of the course. Ensure that all the blocks are aligned with the profiles. Once the last block has been placed, you may proceed to make the first course of the second wall. Start by applying cement slurry on the ground. Now lay a mortar bed of 12 to 15 mm. Apply mortar on the portion of the coin block that will make contact with the first stretcher of the second wall. Place the first stretcher. Continue the same process to complete the rest of the course. Once the course is laid, adjust the blocks to ensure that they are aligned with the profiles. Check the level of the first course using a spirit level placed on top of a straight edge. Now that the course is leveled and aligned, use a trowel to apply mortar into perpens, inserting it into gaps to fill the joints. Set up the profile for the second course of the second wall using the coin and the half block at the end of the course as shown here. Half blocks are placed at the outer ends of every alternate course so that successive perpens are offset. Apply mortar on the side of the coin that will make contact with the next block. Here, we also apply mortar on the side of the last block on the outer edge as there is only one block to be placed to fill the remaining space. Now lay a mortar bed of 12 to 15 mm. Place the last block to complete the second course of the second wall. Shift the profile to the second course of the first wall using another half block on the outer edge.
apply the mortar bed for the first stretcher from the coin. Also apply mortar on the side of the coin block where it will make contact with the next block. Place the first stretcher block and adjust it so that it is aligned with the profiles. Apply mortar for the next block and place it in position, making adjustments to make sure that it is aligned with the profile. Now, apply mortar on the sides of the previously laid blocks that will make contact with the block that will take up the penultimate position. Apply the mortar bed. Place the block to complete the course. Make sure that it is leveled with the string and aligned with the profiles. Use the trowel to insert mortar into purr pens, ensuring that there are no gaps between the blocks. Repeat these steps till you've reached the desired height. When you have completed laying your final course, ensure that purpins and mortar beds on all surfaces are filled and leveled with mortar. You have now learned to build a concrete block wall.